हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम विक्रम फ्रॉम इजी ऑन टेक्नोलॉजीज वेलकम टू माय स्प्रिंग फ्रेमवर्क प्रोजेक्ट वर्क सीरीज आई होप यू आर एंजॉइंग माय वीडियो सीरीज इफ यू हैव नॉट सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल टिल नाउ प्लीज सब्सक्राइब फॉर गेटिंग मोर अपडेट्स एंड दैट्स बिगिन इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई डिस्कस्ड अबाउट हाउ टू डेवलप बिजनेस लॉजिक यूजिंग सर्विस क्लासेज और सर्विस लेयर राइट एंड वी हैव ऑल्सो डिस्कस्ड अबाउट हाउ टू डेवलप द यूजर रिलेटेड बिजनेस लॉजिक अलॉन्ग विद द इम्प्लीमेंटेशन सो इन माई प्रीवियस सेशन आई डिस्कस दी सर्विस लुक एट दिस यूजर सर्विस एंड यूजर सर्विस इंटरफेस दिस इज इंटरफेस एंड यूजर सर्विस दिस इज इम्प्लीमेंटेशन क्लास एंड इन दिस करेंट डिस्कसन आई एम गोइंग टू क्रिएट वन इंटरफेस फॉर द कॉन्टैक्ट सर्विस दिस इज कॉन्टैक्ट सर्विस दिस इज इंटरफेस and uh, this interface will contain operations related to the contact service so let me describe it quickly okay fine so here we have we are planning to describe all the contact specific operations so let me provide here methods one by one so how you will identify the methods so you can check this document this is your requirement document and look at this this is your save contact edit contact list contact search contact delete contact one by one and delete bulk contacts so these are the operations i am going to develop here and i am not going to develop this contact export import because this is in this is not in my scope so let's begin from this save contact so create a method here this is public oh, sorry so public void save contact so pass here contact object right then we can use here update contact this is correct and then delete contact so one by one you can delete by using this integer id integer contact id you can pass here as a which is a primary key and using that primary key you can perform the deletion similarly you can use here multiple deletion using this sorry it's a wrong method i copied just a moment so delete th this is for delete single and this is for delete multiple so you can take here contact ids right then i'm going to provide here find methods so this is public and you will get multiple results so that will be represented as list of contact this is list of contact and this is find user contact why user contact because the person who is logged in can see only his personal phone book contacts so this is the user id so this is important thing so this is user id user id this user id will represent to the person who is recently logged in right now this is for all contacts and this is another method i am going to use here for the free text search so this is text so here all the user contacts will be listed and here the user account will be searched using this given string criteria right it's a free text searching so probably these are the methods but maybe you will forget the meaning of these two methods ideally you should describe all the methods here but i'm going to describe describe only these two because sometime you may be confused here so this method returns all user contact user who is logged in right and this will be your different criteria so let me describe this also so the method returns 
for the method search contact for user based on given free text criteria as based on free text criteria so what we call it this text and what about this user this user is your user ID so you have to search in this user account for using this text criteria right so in fact you can describe here this is user who is logged in and this is the text criteria used to search so this is your actually free text search criteria okay so this is what I am going to implement and uh, this is enough for this video discussion in next video I will talk about how to implement this contact service and if you have any comment regarding this uh, discussion you can ask your query in comments and thank you very much for watching and see you in next video